Well, good evening guys. Uh, today, got off of work and I was a little anxious to get home. Reason being is uh, I just picked up uh, my next little project. Now, uh, I know on my other projects I've been taking a while, but this is gonna be my, per my personal vehicle in the near future, so uh, I'm gonna try and see if I can dedicate more time and make this project go by a lot faster than my other ones. But, I mean, a uh, co-worker had a 1987 Chevy, the uh, square body, so the, I've always liked the square bodies, and in this case, I saw this truck, it's an 87, it is a uh, throttle body fuel injected, so I couldn't say no, guys. Uh, it is a long bed, so I did purchase a frame and a short bed. I'm going to move this cab over and the whole front clip, and uh, I'm going to go ahead and assemble that short, short bed, not this long bed. So let me show you guys, oh, let me get home, and I'll show you guys what the truck looks like. I mean, it's a project, so it's a little beat up, but... Heck, it's gonna, hopefully it's gonna get restored and hopefully, I mean, at the end, it'll look nicer, a lot nicer than what it is. So, let me show you. Truck home and so far, the owner told me, I mean, a co-worker, his name is Danny, he told me that the truck was real nice. I mean, he drove it to the ranch and so on and so forth. So, I mean, he wasn't kidding. I mean, he wasn't uh, pulling my leg or nothing. I mean, the truck is driving real smooth. Engine, I'll show you guys in a bit, I mean, it's purring. Um, it's. I mean, it's not pretty. I mean, it's a little wore down, a little ugly. But uh, I mean, so far, I mean, this thing is driving real nice. No smoke, no sputter. I mean, uh, <laughs> even the ride is smooth. So I'll show you guys in a bit. Let me go ahead and get to the house, and I'll open up that hood, and we'll go ahead and uh, do a walkthrough and see what you guys think. Uh, let me show you how the truck runs. Inside's a mess right now, guys. I mean, stuff is torn, broken. Starts right up. Let me show you under the hood. It's a 305 throttle body injection. I mean, it's all there. It sounds decent, very decent. I was thinking I was going to have to overhaul this engine, but by the sound of it, I may get away from throwing money into the engine right now. Then clean it up and uh, change a few gaskets in there. I'll keep it stock and I'll just build something for it for later. But, I don't know guys, like I said, it's a project, we'll see where this takes us. I really can't say exactly what I'm going to do to it yet, until we start, but I know it's becoming a short bed for sure. Uh, let me go ahead and show you the body and uh, some of the inside. Well guys, uh, this is uh, the truck in question. Uh, this is our next project here, 87 Chevrolet. 305 TBI. I mean, it's a little rough. There's rust color all over the place. Uh, there's no holes in it, so I mean, it looks like a pretty solid little truck to work on. It is a long bed, but like I said, I mean, we got a frame and another bed that we're gonna build. This is gonna become a trailer, I guess. So. Uh, going to be our next little project. Uh, let me show you the inside real quick. Uh, uh, it doesn't have power windows, power locks. I mean, it's all manual. That's one. And uh, AC doesn't work on it, but we are going to get it to work. It used to have rubber instead of carpet, but we're going to work on that too. Uh, bench seat, I think I'm going to keep. I'm going to reupholster and keep. But this is my 87 Chevy pickup, so it's going to take us a little while, a few months, but eventually it will become my daily driver. It used to belong to transportation. So, well guys, 
the grill is going to cha be changed. We're going to go with a four headlight instead of a two. And the, tur the turn signals are going to be inside that grill. And, well, I guess that's it, guys. Well, wheels are going to change. I'm going to go with the, uh, what do they call those wheels, George? That's uh, rally wheels. Rally? Yeah, I'm going to go with just rally wheels, Steve. a beauty ring, and uh, the center cap in them. So those mirrors, I like that style, so that those are staying. What is this? All in all, I mean, I just want to show you guys what we're going to be working on now. There's a bus right there, and of course, uh, I hadn't showed it, but that was uh, an acquisition. I bought this in uh, roughly like a month, month and a half ago. I can't be driving the car and toward to the ranch in and out every day, so I got that one. But soon, it's going to be this one. Well guys, uh, it got dark outside so I couldn't get any other video or pictures or nothing of the truck but I just want to show you guys what our next project is, uh, well, the next project that I'm going to be starting very soon, uh, this weekend hopefully. Uh, guys, any ideas you might have, I mean um, the plan right now is we're going to go through that truck, we're going to pull it apart, frame off completely. And uh, I'm going to paint the underside of the cab. I'm going to paint the inside of the cab. And, of course, the outside. Same for the bed and the fenders. And uh, since I am not that great of a... Well, I, I don't paint cars for a living or not like that. Uh, I want to do everything myself with the help of, of course, my nephew, George. Uh, GT's performance. So I wanted to... I'm gonna, I think I'm going to go with just white. Make it easier. That way uh, imperfections will not show as bad and uh, see what we can get I mean uh, any ideas are appreciated uh, whatever you whatever you guys think if you want if you can go ahead and drop me a comment and let me know I mean I'll take it into consideration but I do want to start and finish this truck in a few months I mean it's gonna take us a while but uh, I want it to be my daily driver so uh, I'm gonna see what other ideas and come up with and uh, what well, Right now, I was going crazy on eBay, trying to find parts. Uh, I already ordered suspension parts, stuff like that. So uh, we're going to go ahead and start tackling that truck. Hopefully, like I said, starting this weekend. All right, guys. Uh, I do appreciate you guys watching. And, uh, well, drop a comment if you can. Like if you can. And, uh, well, I'll see you guys later.